here. When I came out of the vault, I thought something happened. Something's always happening. Something bad. How did you get here? I might have helped. You made my winged helmet and sandals? I saved you and brought you here. So, you know, we're even. He thinks we met before. Just play along. Yes! Your sandals! I'm glad you like your sandals. Oh, I tried. Did you find his essence? You sure you're ready for this? Nothing bad has ever happened ever. Why would it start now? Father of invention, lend me your sword, your spear, your arrow. Transform the darkness to light our way. Welcome back, old friend. You okay, big guy? I remember. Everything. Give it time. There's one thing I still don't understand. With no memory, how did you leave clues leading to Typhon's vault? Not Typhon's. Mine. I suffered so long, I was so tired. Before Typhon came, I used Pandora's box many times to trap my inner torments in that vault. I had a system. I created the clues so I could find my way back. Typhon found me defenseless. I let that monster turn me into one of my automatons. I even enjoyed it. Because automatons feel nothing at all. But your clues... You should have been able to retrieve your own essence. Steropis and Brontis, my assistants, double-crossed me. They took the first clue. The one directing me to light the forge fires, and burned it. No, there's nothing more evil than irony. In doing so, they made sure my prison was permanent. They've paid for their crimes. Good. They stole armor I'd been forging. Consider it yours. And, speaking of payment, I at least owe you. You're going to need it for what we must do next. We're going to steal something. Oh, yes! To protect hope from the clumsiness and sorrow of mortals, Zeus hid its fragile form somewhere near my forge. There, behind the locked door, hope waits. We must release it. I found the key to that locked door in your forge lands. But how do we release hope? Together. That box is now ready for its task. May the light of a thousand forges guide your way. You made it! Not in one piece. I've got bald spots from the feathers I stress shed. Is it because Aphrodite is here? Shut it, no! How do I look? For a chicken, about average. But you'll look better in a few. Now's as good a time as any. Look, it's hard for me to say thanks. But you put up with a lot of clucking around. It was worth every... Good. Now get me out of this clucking chicken suit. To win this 
battle. I will need a mighty ally. I call forth your raging spirit, Ares, god of war. Fight with me. King, <laughs> take me to the battleground. Toss me a weapon. I need something to hit. Yes, sir. We'll be getting to that soon. It's all rushing back to me now. Figure out what you're going to say to win over Aphrodite. I forgot how ripped this body was. I'll let my packs do the talking for me. I'm glad you're feeling yourself. All thanks to you, Phoenix. But we're not done yet. When you come back, I have tasks for you. Time to get this place back in shape. I told you I'd get your essence back. I didn't doubt that. But do you see me differently now that you've heard all my worst thoughts? Not at all. I'm excited to meet the real you. Because honestly, Hermes' hair is a bit much right now. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Then I'm ready. Your passion and love forever be boundless. Rise, golden goddess Aphrodite. Speechless? I know. Can you believe you actually had to convince me to return to this body? Oh, without you, I would have lost the ability to love myself forever. Actually, I stole that years ago. Clearly. Looks like you've been loving yourself far too much. Oh, you might want to disinfect that toga. Oh, glad you're back. Please, Phoenix. Take my final blessing as thanks. Ready to defeat Typhon? I'm more than ready to take down the ugly beast that stole my beauty. But there is one other thing I could use your help with. What can I do? There are four mythical beasts Typhon brought out of Tartarus to terrorize the creatures of the Golden Isle. If you could end their reign by defeating them in battle, I would be extremely grateful. Uh, normally, I wouldn't care, but I guess I'm going soft. I'll take care of it. <laughs> of course you will. Just like we planned. Are you ready? I... I think so.
wise Athena. Gods and mortals will work as one. With your guidance, leading us all. Although, you could have been quicker about it, honestly. And those wings you're wearing, they're a safety hazard. Daedalus' designs are shoddy and ill-conceived. And while we're talking about shoddy and ill-conceived, you, Hermes... Oh, here we go. She's always got something to say. Oh, Athena! Glad you're back. But maybe... uh... <clears throat> yes. Maybe it's time for me to be more judicious with all these judgments. You know, I really admire you. You're critical, but you're also wise. Most of the time. Thank you, Phoenix. And together, we'll begin on a new wise plan. But, um, we can still punch Typhon in the face, right? Phoenix learned that being critical, judgmental, even stubborn, is not always a flaw. It can give one the surety needed to refuse bad counsel. Maybe I should have listened to Athena more often, rather than trying to be right all the time. Perhaps the great Zeus is fallible after all. Ah, uh, no, that's not what I'm saying. My judgments are all pretty great. You... you chained me to a rock. An eagle pecks out my liver every single day. <laughs> I know. We should make a plan to face Typhon head-on. Let us know when you're done attacking him from the shadows. Okay. Now that we're all here, let's do this. We must be cautious in our approach against Typhon. Cautious? We should sharpen our blades, storm his cave, and defile his manhood. Oh, baby. I'm right here. I cannot handle your outbursts anymore. I'm pregnant with Aris's baby, and you can't stop us. Wait until I tell my therapist about this. She'll have my back. Mark my words. <laughs> of course she has your back. It's Echo. She just repeats what you're saying. At least Echo listens to me. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. What would Zeus think of this mess you made, Ares? Mess I made? You just have it out for Ares because he actually takes off his helmet once in a while. That explains the brain damage. Yes. Embrace your dark side, Athena. I can feel a poem coming on. You're such a creep, Hephaestus. Only I can talk to my husband like that, you bloodless harpy. <laughs> oh, so you're defending the blacksmith now? Enough! I'm here, Olympians, and I have a plan. The hero! What, little bro? Thought you'd lost me again? No chance. If I may, Hephaestus, pardon a mortal like me for butting in, you made a set of chains big enough to bind Typhon. They're up on Zeus's mountain. Am I right? Yes, you are. But Typhon, I can sneak up there without alerting Typhon and steal them. Those chains will never hold him. He'll break free. I just need a drop of blood from each of you, and I'll combine that with nectar from Olympus and coat the chains. Problem solved. He's right. That would work. Allow me. Simply extend your hand. I didn't even feel him do it. He's that good. I can't thank you enough. I'll return when the deed's done. What about me? I thought I was coming with you on the mountain. It's gotten way worse out there. Do you know how responsible I'd feel if something happened to you? I'll be fine. You said we'd do it together. Let's not argue, little bro. Stay here. 
gather weapons in case I fail. But I shall not fail. <sighs> that was your brother? Yes. That confident smile. That assertiveness. The way he already knew where my chains are stored. I know, I know. I, I hate, hate him. him. He is the worst. He... he is? How did you ever live with that? He's so annoying. What a suck-up. If I wanted to be talked down to, I'd visit our father. Hey! You're not just going to let him walk all over you like that. Yes, he's going to fulfill the prophecy. Don't worry. Where's that jealousy I saw at my fortress? You want this glory? Seize it! You really think that prophecy isn't about you? Where's the stubborn phoenix who made me listen? What about your pride? You come first. Forget being nice. Avoiding conflict isn't worth it. The pain makes you stronger. I know for a fact that prophecy is yours. You've already fulfilled most of it. What do you want? To be a hero. Then you know what you have to do. Beat the Giron to the top of that mountain. That's right. And we're going to help you. I'll give you a big head start by summoning a storm to blast away the ice blocking the path up the mountain. Since when can you do that? Since Zeus let me borrow a storm to wreck the Greek fleet after the Trojan War. Favorite status comes in handy. <laughs> All I ever got was empty promises. At least you didn't get thrown off a mountain. You think that's bad? Zeus forced me to marry you! None of you want to be his favorite, trust me. Zeus is only trying to make up for the fact that he murdered my mother. The... They're all right. I'm a terrible father. Finally! We have a winner! I'm here selling if you're buying. <laughs>